Oftentimes when patients come in for a rhinoplasty consultation, they feel self-conscious about themselves or how they look in pictures. The, the bump on the bridge, um, most patients most commonly come in complaining of that, uh, but there's all kinds of various other complaints, uh, problems with the lower third of the nose, the tip that droops, or the overly prominent nose, or the overly wide nose, um, those are all common complaints. Oftentimes they also will have uh, breathing complaints and other true medical issues that can be addressed during the rhinoplasty as well. As long as you're fully grown or close to fully grown, almost anyone is an ideal candidate. Uh, we operate on patients who are 15, 16, 17 years old, um, all the way up to patients that are 80 years old when it comes to rhinoplasty. And definitely we send patients to get uh, medically cleared by their internist or their cardiologist or pulmonologist, um, and they need to be in good enough health to undergo general anesthesia, and sometimes general anesthesia for many hours. Um, but I, I rarely find a patient that I can't do, do rhinoplasty surgery on.